Welcome to Jazz Kitchen. Today I have a small recipe here. Uh, I have, as you can see, half a kilo of uh, mutton. Small steak muttons are made. So it will be just a small recipe, not very big. And I'm making macaroni with that. So it will be called uh, garlic steak bites and macaroni, cheese macaroni. And these are the things that will go. I've got one and a half tablespoon of chili. Uh, one teaspoon of black pepper, two, uh, one and a half teaspoon of salt, and I have uh, basil leaves here, and I have garlic powder. And same goes here. I have thyme, chili, uh, two tablespoons of chili, and uh, one teaspoon of thyme, and half a teaspoon of basil. And I have here uh, go, uh, salt, one and a half teaspoon of salt, garlic powder, one teaspoon, and one and a half teaspoon of black pepper. And this is thyme and over here base. Uh, sorry, not bay leaves, bay leaf powder, half a teaspoon of that. And that'll be just a small bite, a small recipe, and it's really nice. I want you to try this at home, and I'm going to mix this first of all. I'm going to mix all these these steak bites, small steak bites. Going to pick. This one, this one, chill up with this, yeah. You add all these in there and then add a bit of oil, olive oil. That's it. And then mix them. And leave these for marinade for at least half an hour. It's a quick recipe, really nice. Now that's all it's done. Leave that for half an hour. And now I'm going to put our macaroni to boil. Right, the water is about to boil. I'm going to add the macaroni. Should be enough. Let this boil until it gets soft. Right, I have one cup of milk in here. Keep stirring so it doesn't stick to the pan until it boils and then you add the cream in there cream cheese cream right guys I mean it is quite warm it's about to boil I'm gonna add the cheese cream in there okay. and then keep stirring and I'm also going to add all the ingredients that I have here in there And then mix it well. Right, now it's boiling, so I'm gonna add cheddar cheese in there. You can add mozzarella cheese as well. You can add cheddar cheese, mozzarella cheese, whichever one you prefer. It's a nice flavor. The cheese is the best thing in there. And add some more. Okay. It's all mixed. And I'm gonna add my. I'm gonna add the pasta in there. The macaroni pasta. I'm 
Now this is ready guys. The taste is really nice, especially with the cheese and cream. Let's add the oil in, olive, oil, the oil, yeah, and we're going to put our steak bites in there. Let this get warm. Small bite. I haven't made them into a good shape, but they're meant to be steak bites. I'm not very good at making shapes, am I? Some garlic in between, some of steak. The flavour of the garlic will go. Put a bit of parsley on it. Sit on one side. And then leave it for three minutes. And then three minutes on the other side. Put in there as well. Just small. In two places. That should be... Um, I think that should be enough. Go to the same place. So, that's it. Right, let's turn up, turn them over. Well, as you can see, it's done. I'm going to turn it over. Turn. Right, this is my finished plate, my finished dish. Small steak bites with the cheesy macaroni, creamy cheesy macaroni. It's a really nice. Nice to have it at lunchtime as well. Try and make it at home. Please do like and share. And let's have a taste. Oh, let's have a full bite. Oh, that looks really nice. Mmm. Well, it's a very simple dish. Really nice. Try this at home. Please like and share. And subscribe my channel. It's so tasty. Please do like and share and subscribe my channel and share it with your friends, families and work colleagues. Do comment and please do try this at home. Inshallah, we'll see you in the next video. This is very tasty.